In this video, we'll demonstrate the reconstruction of the superior capsule in the shoulder using tissue from a donor. When the muscles that move the shoulder, the rotator cuff, is damaged for long periods of time without repair, pain and loss of function occur. The humerus, or the upper part of the arm, becomes displaced and it rises within the shoulder joint. Superior capsule reconstruction uses donor tissue to restore the position of the shoulder, reducing pain, and may restore function in patients with injury to the rotator cuff. First, the shoulder is evaluated and bicep surgery is performed. Then the surgeon prepares the tissue and bone for the superior capsular reconstruction by keeping the surface even and clean, followed by punching holes in the shoulder bone. Then two pairs of different anchors with sutures are inserted into the shoulder bones. Next, the distance between the anchors is measured, helping to determine the size of the donor tissue that will be placed over the bone. Holes are punched in the donor tissue in relation to where the anchors are on the bone. Then the sutures from the anchors are passed through to the holes made in the donor tissue. One set of sutures is tied over that, helping to pull the donor tissue to the damaged site in the shoulder joint. The remaining sutures are tied over the donor tissue. The surgeon then follows up with another repair creating a figure eight pattern for the rest of the sutures. Finally, the sutures are tied between the remaining rotator cuff and the donor tissue to join them together. Repairing the donor tissue to native tissue helps the overall function of the shoulder joint after surgery.